Hey, hey. Check out my Patreon. Check out the Discord server in the little description below. And remember to check my website for all the latest written guides, sirtaptap.com. See you there. I'm Sir Tap Tap, and today we're going to take a look at the New Year's event stuff and, most importantly, these weird little hiding fish that everyone seems to be super confused about. Now, as is pretty common in Abyssrium, a big part of the confusion, I think, is just because of the English is really rough. So there's hiding fish, and they are completely unrelated to hidden fish, which are an unrelated, completely separate thing that has an almost identical name that, that, yeah, they don't, <laughs> they obviously do not have anyone that natively speaks English. Or just like an editor. I, I've, I've talked to them on Facebook. Well, talked to them. I've sent them messages on Facebook and be like, hey, you guys could really benefit from an English language editor that, um, even if they use their current translator, um, surname Google, I believe. Uh, <laughs> if they use their c current translator and, you know, just have a native English speaker edit it um, and fix up some of their UI text, um, clear up some stuff, um, I would love to help them out with that, you know for pay, of course, but um, I would also love to help them with their UI stuff. They have some really weird UI decisions that I've gone about through earlier videos, but they don't seem very interested in improving their product. Anyway, we're going to talk about these hiding fish, so just hopefully you've already noticed this part, but they've kind of they've done the New Year's event thing again. Every, everyone probably already has all of these. I didn't, I didn't bother to do a video on it since it's really just log in once per day. No, you can't get duplicates. That's why I can't believe they did that again because last year the complaint was kind of, hey, I want a bunch of these New Year jellies. Uh, the lantern fish or the lantern jellies are beautiful and I would love to have, you know, the whole point of the Chinese New Year thing. Uh, it's have, you have a bunch of these beautiful um, floating lantern things, paper lanterns, like uh, stupid camera. It's so frustrating that it just steals your focus. Um, where'd he go? There. See, wouldn't it be beautiful to have, like, 50 of these things in the tank? You know? That's... You always see those pictures of Chinese New Year. There's tons of all these lanterns. But you only get one. But they didn't... <laughs> that's a problem they carried over from last year. You still only get one. I mean, you get a second one if you played it. So, you know, if you want 50, just play the game for 50 years. Easy, Easier said than done. <laughs> um, there is also this New Year's gift... Which I don't know if that's supposed to have the same name as this thing or if it's different. But um, these have some unlocks related to the hiding fish. And this is where a lot of people have gotten very confused because they're like, what's a hiding fish? Um, they also added this new icon. Which, I mean, it does say new hiding fish. <laughs> I, I, think, I think people would just get hung up on hiding fish because it's like hidden fish. But no, these are the hiding fish and it's basically just a gashapon. Um, what you do here, it has a bunch of different things to select. Um, to get the golden fish, which is like the, um, you know, you need to own all of these different fish. And you click, I oh, know you click this to get a list of the fish. Um, these numbers are basically lies, fun fact. Um, but basically how it works, you pick a fish that you want to focus on. Each fish has this kind of list and... Um, you really should focus on finishing them one at a time because the way it works is that you're basically, it's basically a gashapon system if you've heard of it or a lottery system. Um, it works kind of like the luck shell. So as you play this, you know, you'll make a fish out of either farm materials or event items. I usually go for the farm materials, but I have a lot more of those than farm, than event items. That is an ugly young man, I am sorry to say. That, that is a fish. Um, <laughs> Red-lipped batfish. So, as you purchase these, it tells you that the rates change so that like the, um, the rare ones come more likely. From what I have heard, from what people have kind of tested, it does not actually seem to be the case that these rates increase. Um, basically all you need to know about these fish is that it takes roughly 60 to 70 purchases of new fish to get one of each, and that's what unlocks the gold fish. Um, the golden fish. So, it's very frustrating, it's completely random, 
just budget roughly 60 purchases and they get more expensive as this time goes on and you get little rewards to kind of you know make you shut up about not getting anything but it's still it's still a not very fun system that's why i didn't really bother making a video on it before um it really all is just luck you really have to just put in roughly 70 pulls on average and you will probably get one of each fish that is pretty expensive i think if I keep making these, you'll see the price go up. Um, if not, the price does go up. That's all you really need to know. Um, if you only want new fish, if you do not give a crap about the golden fish, and they are gaudy and stupid looking, in my opinion. Um, I like the golden one. I like this one kind of. Honestly, eh. It is a bit gaudy still. But if you just care about getting new fish and you don't care about which fish you get... Um, there's a couple of common fish and a couple of uncommon fish in each set. You will very easily obtain very many of these. Um, basically these ones here. Also, look at these percents! <laughs> 50%, 50%, 40%, so that's about, yeah, that's about 200%. How many, how many hundred percents fit into 100? It's two, right? It's 200? Yeah. Like I said, the numbers the numbers don't work and the points the points don't matter. Uh, just 60 to 70 pulls is all you need to know. Uh, if you don't care about getting the golden fish, just play these until you get one of each of the kind of common ones. And then I would just move on to the other ones. Um, if you are trying to get the golden fish, the opposite strategy. Only focus on one until you get the golden fish. Because you're just never going to get them until you get them. So, um, these fish previously did not matter there was no gameplay reason to do them there is currently almost no gameplay reason to get them except there is this new year's gift event um by the way like all abyssrium events um these lower tier um missions do not count until you complete the prior ones so if i say touched a bunch of bubbles of hiding fish right now and i didn't harvest the seaweed it wouldn't count this wouldn't count so, and that's almost always the case. Basically assume, always assume the worst when it comes to Abyssarium, frankly. Um, uh, the, it's always the most frustrating, the slowest, um, the silliest possible way. Um, very rarely is there any difference. So, you're going to have to make 50 hidden fish after all of this. Which, oh god. Guys, do you think that means hiding fish or do you think that means hidden fish? Oh, that's, oh, that's, that's astounding. That's incredible. I didn't even realize that one. Oh, oh, that's fun. Woo. Um, yeah, I, I honest, I don't know which one that is. I, <laughs> I guess someone will just have to unlock that and, and let me know. Let, let me know in the comments. I'm sure somebody's already gotten it. Um, this event is not brand new or anything. Um, I just didn't do a video on it until previously. Oh, um, one more final thing. I should have mentioned this earlier. Um, juvenile spade fish is back. Before you, uh, before you throw up your hands in celebration, um, they did this by removing the Facebook feature entirely, and it's now been changed to own three goldfishes, which is not goldfish, it is these boys. So you need to do, you know, that's a minimum of around uh, 180 to 200 Gashapon spins on this to get three different golden fish that will unlock the spade fish. Fortunately... The 100 year, 1000 year old blue whale still only requires 113, so the, it's technically not required to get the juvenile spade fish to get the 1000 year old blue whale. Um, spade fish unlock still sucks. Also, bad news for anyone that wanted Facebook cloud save in um, Abyssrium Pole. It looks like that was omitted on purpose because they've just completely removed it from this game. And that's a shame. I, I hate Facebook. I deleted my personal Facebook. Um, really do not like the platform, do not like the company, do not like anything involved, but um, the Facebook save was the only way to tra cross save between iOS and Android, so that is no longer a thing that you can do, unfortunately. I'm not really surprised they removed it because it was broken for over a year. Not even kidding. Over a year. It was just in the game, and that fish was impossible to get until, you know, just about last week, I think they finally did that fix. So... Hopefully you're a little bit less confused about the hiding fish. 
Um, still, <laughs> it's still confusing, but, you know, only so much you can do. Um, like I said, it really is just Gashapon and luck. If it feels bad, it's because Gashapon is bad and it's designed to make you feel bad, basically. It's, uh, ugh. You know, I played Shenmue 3, and, like, one of the few things to do in that game is a bunch of Gashapon things. It's like, oh, why is this? Why is this a feature? My least favorite part of other games. Just put a bunch of that into one game. Oh, thanks. But yeah, if you don't care about the golden fish, this feature is almost kind of nice, because you can get some free new fish. They don't count towards vitality, by the way. I should have mentioned that earlier. Uh, these... Oh, that is... I like this boy! This is a fine boy. See, the fish... I just wish the fish weren't such a pain in the butt to get. If I could just look at the fish. I just want to see the fish. But see, there's some decent fish in here that you can get for almost no effort. It's just really the golden fish are really blurg and just unpleasant. What? Interesting. Okay, that's like a semi-event fish. These hidden fish lists are weird. Can you tell? I haven't. I haven't been bothering to uh, to do these. Transparent sea toad. That's so weird though. They mix real fish with like the starfish. That is weird. That's really weird. Huh. I don't entirely object, but it's just such a weird way to go about it. Look at this gaudy mother. These. See, I like the fish. It's just like. I don't want to do a Gashapon for him, you know? And these early ones, these these are no problem. That's why I say, just if you're willing to just ignore the golden fish, it's just some new colorful fish to look at for free. Um, it's really once you're trying to get the very last fish, that's where it becomes frustrating. Um, see, once you try to get these carpet sharks... I've got a carpet shark right around here. Barker, where are you at? Well... <laughs> I already have a car carpet shark, so I don't think I need that, but, uh... <laughs> um, that is hiding fish. Hopefully that, you know, eases some confusion. Um, just kind of note, 60 to 80 um, spins of the wheel to get each golden fish is what you're going to expect. Um, this thing, complete these in order, because, you know, it's going to be slow going. Um... Look at that tiny boy. Why is that boy that much tinier? Anyway, um, <laughs> that that's your Bistrium video for the month, I guess. Um, probably going to be a Valentine's event next week. They released a big old thing. It's on my site. Um, they released a event plan thing for the rest of the year. So don't worry about a Bistrium poll, meaning no events for a regular Bistrium. Um, at least through this year, there is an event plan for every month. So... I guess in a week or so, I'll be doing a video about whatever the Valentine's thing is. So, see you then. Have fun. Check out my Patreon if my uh, videos help you out. Alright gamers, remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell. Frog, what are you doing in my house? I, I, I would just get out.